What's up guys? So this week's food review is right here in Deerfield Beach at the Whale's Rib. Right behind us. And Melissa and I have been here a couple times. We brought some special guests today. <laughs> That's Jason and Joe. I'm here for the whale juice. <laughs> That's what she said? So we're gonna go in here, have a couple things that they're known for, and bring y'all with us. Or is it just like... That's delicious. What do you got, babe? Dirty martini, nice and salty. <laughs> <laughs> so one of the staple items that this restaurant is known for is their whale fries. Which is basically just homemade potato chips. <laughs> so they're gonna try it for the first time. I did. You can't have it without the juice. Juicy. I did. It's so juicy. Yeah. I heard you. Have juice they, they heard juice. Why is it so white? <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, well, well. Jason, it's in your beard. Jason, I give the whale juice in your beard. Twelve out of ten. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What are you doing? Oh, it's a bite. We're all. Wow. Oh, really? Corona. Corona. Oh, Corona. Oh, Corona. Oh, Corona. Oh, Corona. Oh, Corona. What is, what is this for the people on YouTube? <laughs> Kind fritters. These look amazing. I want to jump on the fries and then. Oh boy. The cock sauce. I think so. But these are, these are the best. I actually like the Naughty Dogs cock fritters better. Uh oh. It's a house divided. Like, these look more deep fried and better, but the inside is just too mushy. Whereas the Naughty Dog was kind of mushy, but it didn't feel like it was filled with breadcrumbs like these are. I think it's so the same I one. switched it up from a salty, salty, dirty martini to a Cosmo. So refreshing. So what's the difference? This one has cranberry juice and lemon, and the other one was like olive juice, so salt water. Lobster bisque. Oh, wait. Oh. Mm. Creamy, not chunky. <laughs> so you're gonna give it a I've, solid nine. I've had lobster bisque in Massachusetts, so oh I have to give this like now we're eight. state dropping. Eight 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 or nine. All right, yeah. see. Six well, I'm gonna two. give it a ten every time because I like it. Okay. Ten. <laughs> Compared to Campbell. All right, so I got one of their staples here. It's the dolphin sandwich. Thank you. It's a piece of blackened dolphin with coleslaw and cheese and their whale sauce. And then I got some fried grouper sticks because they're out of dolphins. So. And what's cool is these come with their whale fries. <laughs> they're, adult, ah. they're adult fish sticks, right? I got the baked stuffed shrimp. I got the childhood favorite, the fried clam strips, as I'm eating with my mouth full. I used to get these over on the pier when it was like a really old, crappy restaurant. So I figured I'd relive my childhood. <laughs> I think they're Gordon's just reheated, but I'm not going to complain. <laughs> a great break from the usual. Chicken sandwich. You went with a safe bet. Why had a safe? It has some sprouts on it. Um, <clears throat> not a huge fan of the amount of bread that it comes on, so I took it off the bread. What are you, um, keto? Not keto, <laughs> carb conscious. <laughs> um, you guys should come down here and try this for, I think it's like 14 bucks. <clears throat> then, take the sandwich, dip it. In the juice? In the juice. Oh, it's so juicy. Like this. This fumble brought two by two days. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I found more. Mm. 